If you want to make friends in Serbia, you just need to do one thing, get out of the house because it's really easy, people are really friendly. We were really lucky because we met a lot of uh, local people that were that was working for our organization. Um, I think especially for foreigners, when they see that you're a for foreigner and you are willing to learn about the country or are you willing to integrate, they're really open and wanting you to be their friend or want to want you to show their house or their family or their food or anything. Zdravo i dobar dan. Here we are on my third Slava in Anna's house today and uh, well, it looks like we are going to have a lot of guests, a lot. I've been in friends' houses, visiting, meeting their families and they were hugging me, kissing me, they kissed three times here and I was impressed because it's really, really friendly. When I was alone in the square, I just sat down uh, 10 minutes, no, 5 minutes, and then I was immediately surrounded for 15 Roma kids uh, asking for uh, where I was, um, uh, where, where I lived or what I was doing here. It was, it was really nice. Okay, we are gathered here because Jasper is out of town, and you know what that means. Are we going to prepare another prank in his room? And where did he go, anyway? Shut up, you human. This is serious business. I had this little war with my roommate. I admit, I have tortured Jasper. He's my flatmate and I, I've dedicated man, uh, a lot of my time to prepare pranks. Let us review the war so far. A few months ago, you guys started soft. He retaliated in your door too, but he went too far. Yeah, but then we got him good. Well done, gentlemen. Very well done for that. And then the bastard made a spider web in my room, making me jump at his will for chocolates. So he had no chance but to call up the big guns. Uh, one day he recreated the first scene of Lion King in my room with all those animals cut it out in paper and all the leaves through my whole room. Yeah, but when we thought we had won the war... He built Mini Holland in your room during the Euro Cup. I have scared him, I have prepared traps in his room. But it's cool because I always do this to my, to my housemates. It's, it's a good uh, welcoming ritual. He should prepare because he's going to school, to film school soon and he should prepare for the worst. So better learn it from me. And then all the moments we passed uh, in the garden or filming for Angelo's movies. <laughs> and we're hosting one event, uh, public uh, faculty. <laughs> again, 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 still recording. Well, once my son, Jasper, appeared home with a huge hole between his legs. And I thought, okay, tell me the story. And the worst part is that he not only embarrassed himself, but in front of, I don't know, maybe 15 girls. He, was, he went to this hip hop dance class that someone invited him. He wanted to make friends. I said, go, my friend, go. And he came back embarrassed because they said, ah, you danced before, show us some moves. And he's like, well, I'm, I'm not ready to do anything special, but I can do a handstand, circus stuff, okay? And when he was about to do the handstand, I don't know what he did, but he ripped his pants and everybody was like, what the fuck? We played a lot of pool, billiard or whatever, and I always win. I ha I'm, I'm completely unbeatable. Um, they might deny it, but 
you, the viewers, know me. I don't lie. <laughs> we sang a lot. I put them singing a lot. Okay, time for some deep thoughts. EVS is more than a service. It's a exploring your self-experience. You will find out who you are and uh, you will only start learning when you leave your comfort zone. So I hope you really make a good decision and come.